<laughs> I will puke if I eat that. What's up guys? I'm in Japan. If you don't know, check out the vlogs. that will update you on whatever the heck I'm doing in Japan currently. But I've brought to you guys a special little video for you. We have random snacks from Japanese convenience stores, mostly 7-Eleven. And I had a few friends like Atsu, for example, to pick out some weird ones that I may or may not puke from. But yeah, literally, we are just taste testing random snacks from Japanese convenience stores because they look very interesting. I mean, look at this one, Moses. This is truffle and chicken liver. Consomme flavor? Consomme? Consomme? What does that even mean? We have Kit Kat sake flavored, the alcoholic drink, which is also weird. But yeah, that's that's literally what we're doing today. Let's see. Honestly, I'll start with truffle and chicken liver. Also, if I seem tired, it's because I am. I have not had breakfast. This is my breakfast. Truffle chicken liver. I smell the truffle. I smell it. Oh no. Oh wow. I don't really know what the liver tastes like, but I taste the truffle and chicken. I taste it. It's pretty good. It's not bad. I like it. I honestly like it. It's not bad. You know, Japan is like, I don't know why it's Japan. Maybe it's other countries too, but I've seen so many strange foods. Like, oh, I saw Maylene tweet that th there was an ad for Burger King's bacon milkshake or something like that. And I was like, that is just so weird. I, like, I would never think of that combo while living in America. I like it. Oh. I think I taste the liver in that one. The chicken and truffle stronger, but there is some liver taste. I think I, I think that's what it was. Anyways, next one. This bad boy. We'll just do all the chips first. This, I don't even know what this looks like. What does this even look, what is this? What is that? It's like ham and garlic with mayonnaise. Ooh, I don't know if I like that smell. It smells like cheese, old cheese. It's like ham and cheese? I don't even know. Yeah, I, I, no, no, okay. Next chip. This is like oyster, squid, and anchovies. I do like squid, I do like oyster. I don't know if anchovies is a good combo with chips. I'm gonna have to eat this all today. I'm gonna feed it to the dog, maybe. My imaginary dog that I have. There's like a lot of black specks on it. A lot of seasoning. Um. Yeah, I think it's just oyster. Oh yeah, that is 100%. Oh, the oyster is the strongest in it. And it doesn't taste that great. All right, next weird chip of the day. Strong. Looks like spaghetti, cheese, spaghetti. No, it's ham. Ham? Ham and spaghetti, I think? Bruh. It de oh, it smells like ham. This smells more like bacon than the... Did we have bacon chips yet? This just smells like bacon. I like it. It's just bacon. It just tastes like bacon. Bacon chips. I'm so hungry. I might just eat this whole bag. Oh god. This is the one Atsu bought me. Crunchy ume plums with no artificial food coloring. That's so great that they didn't include artificial food coloring. That's so awesome. That's so cool. Wow. I'm not looking forward to that. That That is gross. Alright, one more chip. One more. Wait, I bought two of these? Whoops. Alright. Corn. Pottage. I have no idea what this is. It's probably just corn. Oh, oh, it's so sweet. It's like really, it's like really super sweet corn. It's like extreme. Whoa. I'm not a huge fan of sweet corn stuff. Oh, that's whoa. Okay. Almond cookies, milk and wheat. It looks soft. Oh, they're hard. I feel it. Hello. I like it. It's just almond cookie, which is powdered. Yeah, not bad. It's really sandy though. You need water with this. All right, what's next? Well, what's, what is this? Another chip. What is this? Bacon? What's that? Is that bacon mayonnaise? and like something else. Ow. Oh, wow, that is, that literally smells like bacon and mayonnaise. Oh, that's, this is this, this is what they look like, the side thing, that's the chip. It just looks like this. Hell no, man, what the fuck? 
Wow, it is a bacon mayonnaise rice cracker. That's what it is. Honestly, favorite snack. I like this a lot. I don't know why. Maybe because it's so crunchy. This is so weird, but it tastes good. There's so little in it though. All right, next snack. Balls. There's like some sort of frog on this. I hope this isn't frog balls, but it sure looks like orange, like Cheeto puff balls with seaweed on it. Let's see. Okay, maybe it's like a takoyaki thing. Mm. Oh, it is. It's like the, the octopus ball seasoning. Not a huge fan of that. Not a huge fan. All right, next, next. Ramen French fry chip. <laughs> <laughs> Ramen french fry chip? Maybe something? What? Oh! It's okay, it's literally a french fry chip. I mean, like, taste, like, reminds me of parts of ramen, but I don't know what parts. Yeah, that's weird. I don't like that, though. The aftertaste is weird. Ugh. All right, here's something different. Just kidding, we're not doing this. It's another chip. Surprise. This is a... Well, again, nothing indicating what kind of flavored chip it is, but it's a chip. It looks glazed. It's like a glazed chip. It's always like a risk just trying random snacks because I don't know if I'm gonna like it or not. Like I might like full on yak. Oh, it's sticky. It's like a really small one, but. What the? It's soft. Did you hear that? I've never seen a, so it's so hard to the touch. Oh my. What the? All right, it's hard to hold, hard to the touch, but when you bite it, it's soft. I have no idea what this flavor is. It's like a sweet, soft, maple-y thing almost. Maybe brown sugar? Hello. You wanna try some? Yeah. Here, you can have, my favorite one right now is this. Whoa. I know. Whoa. I know. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Yeah, it's really good. Hey guys, let me know if you like this. If you want me to try more snacks, let me know and I'll just gather a bunch of random snacks I can find from like convenience stores from where I travel. Nice. All right, in the meantime, more balls. Type balls if you're watching this far. This is uh, ball number one. Oh, they're peanuts. There's like seaweed flavored ball peanuts and other flavored ball peanuts. Miso, there's a miso, miso rice cracker flavor surrounding the peanut. It's a rice crack, it's a flavored rice cracker surrounding the peanut. It's a double crunch peanut. That is weird. I have not had that. And when I, when I say weird, I mean like that's different, you know? I, I don't mean it in a bad way. All right, let's try a sweet. Pure blueberry. Blueberry sugar gummy. It's in the shape of like a heart. It's a heart. It's a little sour. Oh, it's like a, it's just a blueberry sour patch. That's nice. I like sour patches a lot, so. This is a W. Oh, I gotta stop, stop. All right, you know what? Now it's time. I've eaten a lot of snacks. I've liked some, I didn't. But now it's time to try something that might murder me. The two bombs, two bad boys. I'm scared of this one, so I'm gonna leave that one for last. I will try the Vine Guard Seaweed with Pickle Plums. Oh no, I have to fart. I farted, but we're gonna cut that out. Don't put that in, I swear to God. Oh Jesus, oh, oh no, no. I don't know if I'm gonna like this, it looks wet inside. I'm doing this for you guys. I don't know if I'm gonna like this, 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 this looks so gross. Smell test. Oh, it doesn't smell that bad actually. It's like fragrant. It smells like the det detergent a hotel would use for like their blankets. It doesn't smell that bad. It's not wet, but it's like, it's wet. I lied, it's wet. It's like slimy and wet. Oh, it's slipping. Okay, I'm gonna try it. <sighs> no, no. I do not, no, this is, no, no. It was a slimy texture. It, I, my, my mouth was not having enough friction with it. I could not grasp the food I was swallowing. This is, no, this is the no pile. This is the ined unedible. I will, I will puke if I eat that. Anyways, let's try this, uh, let's, let's do this. Let's do something that looks, looks better. I don't know what this is. The patisserie quality. It's like a tart or something. Oh, it's packaged separately. Oh, 
<gasps> well, definitely doesn't look like the picture. Um, this is the picture. Picture and then reality. Huh. Oh, I like it. It's like a taro taro cookie. I was like, good. You know, speaking of cookies, ready for a raisin sandwich? Raisin cookie sandwich. Oh my god, I'm eating so many snacks. Cup to this packaging. It smells like nice, I guess. Is there some custard filling in it with the raisin sandwich? It's not awful. It's soft, it's cr like bready, so like bready, soft, crummy sandwich raisin. I'm not a huge fan of it. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not a huge fan. Ah, I'm not a huge fan. All right, next. Bacon, more bacon, sick. Bacon, asparagus, bacon, ra bacon wrapped asparagus? Bacon, it's straight up bacon wrapped asparagus. It smells like asparagus. It looks like a french fry. It's hollow. It's really good. I taste the asparagus first, then the bacon. Which is weird, because like the bacon's on the outside, right? So wouldn't you taste it first? Or maybe because you bite into the bacon asparagus, you get the inside of it, because you're opening it. Which is the asparagus first, and then you finish with the bacon, because it's on the outside. Anyways, this is good. I like it. New, new fave. Mmm. We like. Next, we have... Oh, the packaging's so cute, look. It's like a carrot, carrot bites? Carrot bits? Carrot potato, veggie bits? Those are potatoes. There's like potatoes and carrots here. Maybe they're veggie bites, I don't know. There's, I think they're veggie bites, like veggie chips. They're veggie chips. They're like veggie straws that we have in America, but they're just like a little differently shaped. It's just veggie straws. Anyways, we have a lot of chocolates to try. Maybe I'll leave that for last after this plum, because this plum is gonna be the worst ever, worst thing ever. Strawberry flavored caramel corn. Caramel or caramel, which one is it? It's like a Cheeto puff, but strawberry. Ooh, it's like a caramelized crystally strawberry. I can like feel the sugar crystals on my tongue. Maybe that just means that this is really unhealthy for me and super sugary. It was really good though. I'm giving this a sacky. Here, you eat this. It's for you. Mm. <laughs> mm. She loves it guys. All right, enough messing around. It's time for what Atsu chose, plum. I don't even know. It's crunchy ume plum. I don't even know what an ume plum is. I'm not gonna be a baby about it, guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just do it, okay? I'm gonna be for real. I'm gonna eat it. So it's crunchy, so that means it's hopefully not slimy like the other one. Okay, wow. They, it's straight up just like a dried out ume plum. What is an ume plum? What is this? Like, oh no. Oh. <coughs> oh no, it smells like feet. Saki, come here. Smell this. It smells like feet. Mm, I think it smells delicious. Are you serious? I love pickled stuff. Are you serious? Yeah. Okay, eat it. That sounds good. Whoa, it's crunchy. Yeah, it's crunchy. I like it. You like this? It's okay. Actually, <coughs> no, I don't. You don't like it? No, I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like. I don't like the smell of it. Oh God. I'm, uh, I need a napkin for this. All right, listen up. If you're watching this far, it means you like watching me try random snacks or you love and really want to watch me suffer. Either way. found out today I do not like crunchy ume plums. I tasted like, it was like acidic. I felt like acidity in my, on like, on, in my mouth and my tongue, you know what I mean? And then, and then it just, it was really crunchy even though it felt super soft. Sake Kit Kat. I do not know if this actually contains alcohol. It says the elegant taste of sake wrapped in the gentle sweetness of a white chocolate. Enjoy the rich, satisfying flavor of sake. If you don't know what sake is, it's a, basically an alcohol. Oh. Yo, it smells like sake. <laughs> it smells like it. Hmm. 
Yeah, the sake pays, pairs well with the white chocolate, actually. Yeah, not bad. Like, when I taste sake, I know it's like a little alcoholic -y taste, so it's a little weird, but it tastes good. Thumbs up. Better than the f bum sh ate. Jesus Christ. I've had way too many flavors in my mouth today. I've actually had way too many flavors in my mouth. Dude, what the heck? All right, next dessert. We had a full course meal of snacks. Dessert time. Strawberry milk, strawberry on the outside, some kind of like, oh look, they poured the gooey milk on the inside, and then, I don't know. I don't know what, I, I have no idea what this is. Oh, it's so big. What the? It's like a thumb. It was like hard to bite into. How do I describe this? It's like a cracker. It's like a soft cracker. Soft strawberry milk cracker. It's not chewy at all. I'm gonna give this a sake. I'm just giving all my stuff a sake to try. Let's try this one. This is really good. Bacon asparagus. You're gonna taste the asparagus first and then the bacon after. Wow, that's kind of good. <laughs> See, I wasn't lying, guys. All right, Melty Kiss. Melty Kiss. I think it's just strawberry chocolate. I don't know if it's worth a try since we already had a lot of strawberry stuff. I'll speed run it real quick though, just for you guys. Just in case like you wanna know. Oh, push that down and I guess you pull it out. Oh, what the? Oh, oh one fell out. That's so cute, look at the packaging. All right, ooh, pretty. I don't actually like this. It is, it tastes too artificial. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. It was like, it's like chocolate, strawberry, white chocolate, but it tasted like, I don't know, I don't like it. I don't know. All right, next candy. Premium Dars. It's like a, it's a pistachio chocolate. Pistachio cracker? There's, there's pistachio. It's pistachio. What in the world? It came in a whole ass package. That's interesting. Wow, that pistachio smell is really strong. As right as I open this, I just could get a huge whiff of it. But it comes in like, it's packaged like a chocolate bar, right? But they're all separate pieces in it. Ooh, pretty good. I like pistachio. Creamy chocolate on the outside, white chocolate. And then that nutty nut, nut. Pistachio nut flavor. Do you know what I mean by nutty? I don't know how to explain, it's like nutty. Whatever. Anyways, down to the last three. This is also pistachio. It turns out I bought two pista- Wait, this is pistachio and berry. What the? Oh, okay, this is different. Pistachio and berry. You see what I mean? It's put, it's like ordered like a chocolate bar, but it's all separate. It's like pre-broken chocolate bar. I don't think the berry was a good addition. It tastes kind of like too chemically. I don't know. No, that's not it. That's not the way. There's this, and then there's this. You kind of know what this is. It's like a chocolate pocky, but chocolate on the inside, pocky on the outside. Chocolate filled cracker straw thing, and then a cheese tart. So these are familiar flavors. I'm gonna 50-50. Let's see, you ready? Well, I know what they feel like. I don't know why I would. Saki. Yes. All right, right hand or left hand? Left. Okay, cheese tart. I'm trying a cheese tart. You just chose what I'm trying. Oh. It smells, oh, ooh. It smells like really, really fake, like lunch, school lunch cheese. Oh, I know what you're talking about, like craft cheese. Yeah, like craft cheese. <laughs> Very mid. Very mid. All right, guys. Well, that's it. Those are all the snacks that I've picked. And honestly, that bacon asparagus one was pretty good and the other bacon one. If I had to put like snacks at the top of the list for me, it was definitely the chips. Plums, the plums stay at the bottom. I'm sorry, if you like plums, that's awesome. But for me, the pickled plum, like texture, slime, seaweed thing stuff, that was not the way for me. Press that like button. I'll see you guys later. In a Japan vlog, maybe. Subscribe to catch those. Bye bye.